The Department of Agriculture, uh, Fisheries Division, uh, is responsible for uh, the work in the framework of the, uh, of the United Kingdom and uh, that works within the framework of the EU. Is it all fisheries that you're, that you're responsible for? All sea fisheries including mariculture, uh, the inshore fisheries, the offshore fisheries and uh, the intertidal fisheries where oysters are, are, are grown as well. Uh, and Northern Ireland has one salmon farm at two sites off the East Antrim coast. We license those too. And of course you've got a devolved administration now so that has Westminster used to be uh, the authority but now a lot of their powers are devolved to Belfast, Edinburgh and Cardiff. Um, at the end of the day the government are the uh, are the end managers but they rely a lot on the POs to do the groundwork for them. I think it's absolutely crucial uh, that uh, we're able to take uh, care of the resource. Uh, there's a lot of restrictions in fishing and you need to have the adequate resource to, uh, to enforce those restrictions. Originally back in the 1980s for enforcement we needed to use the Royal Navy uh, in the IRC. A uh, very limited resource and it was quite well stretched because they had uh, much greater demand uh, in the southwest approaches and in the northern North Sea with competing priorities. So we went our own way and purchased our own uh, patrol craft and then we, uh, we made an investment to get this with EU grant aid, which gives us not only a, 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 the ability to board vessels but also to take part increasingly in uh, much more uh, detailed environmental surveys. Each administration puts its own rules and regulations in, in its own waters but fishermen don't stay in one set of waters, they move from area to area. And uh, for instance, the rules and regulations that the Scots would bring in would be different. So when we're fishing the Clyde, it's a job to know whose rules and regulations we'll have to abide by, whether it's our own people or whether it's the Scots people. You know, sort of technically speaking, it's bloody difficult. You're working between, I think, something like three or four different administrations in different areas when you go up into the North Channel, just off Northern Ireland there.